Hi everyone and welcome to Island Block. Now in today's video, I'll be showing you how you can enable the DAP feature on your iOS device. Now Trust Wallet released a statement stating that the reason for removing the DAP feature on iOS devices was mainly to comply with Apple, Apple's App Store guidelines. So they stated that it doesn't affect Android users, which is why Android devices can still just download Trust Wallet from their Play Store and have the DAP feature automatically enabled. But then, for iOS users, for those that um, either did an update or downloaded the app from June 22nd, from after the 22nd of June 2020, this feature was automatically disabled. So now I'll be showing you how you can instantly enable this feature safely on your iOS device. Now for those that don't have Trust Wallet installed on their devices yet, all you have to do is to go to the App Store, then search Trust Wallet. Then you install the first one. So now that you're done installing it, the next thing to do will be to click open. Then I would create a new wallet. Now, if you already have a wallet, you can just click on I already have a wallet and import your existing wallet. But then I would like to create a new wallet. So I'm clicking create a new wallet. I've read and accepted the terms of service. Continue. I understand that if I lose my recovery words, I will not be able to access my wallet. Now, this is very important. You need to back up your 12 seed phrase because if you lose it and your app gets uninstalled or your data gets deleted from your app, you automatically lose access to all your funds. But if you have backed up your 12 word phrase, then you can always recover your wallet. So I'll click continue and I'll head on to back up this 12 word recovery phrase now once you're done backing up your 12 seed phrase you would click ok because now your wallet has been successfully created now the next thing for you to do would be for you to go to your safari browser now, if you look here in the trust wallet app you would see that i do not have my dap enabled automatically so you go to your safari browser then you type trust colon slash slash browser underscore enable so as you type this and you press go then they'll ask you to open this in your trust which is your trust wallet app that you already have installed then you click open now as you can see i have instantly enabled the browser section on my wallet now if you click on it you might see this error show up something went wrong and you might press retry and still keep showing up that is still fine if i visit a website let's say pancake swap And I make sure I'm using the BSC network because PancakeSwap is on the BSC network. As you can see at this top, my wallet is still connected and I can interact and trade on the PancakeSwap exchange. So it is still working perfectly. Thank you so much for watching and do have an awesome time. Bye-bye.